Hi, Libra. All right, Libra, let's see. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node. All right, August 15th, this is your energy read. All right, before I get started, I got to give a shout out to my, you know, to my soul fam, the Hood Mystic. Go subscribe to his channel if you are a deep diver. If you have a billion dollar vibe, if you want some spiritual, if you want the spiritual shit with us, go, go, go subscribe to his channel, okay? That's my soul fam. Fuck with him, all right? I fuck with him, okay? So, I mean, esoteric astrology, esoteric tarot. Like, I mean, if you really, if you want to dive deep, if you ain't no deep diver, don't, don't do it because you gotta, you gotta be, you gotta be on some intelligent shit. But I, I think Libra, I think, I think you can handle him though. The hood mystic, I think he, he'd be good for you. Real cerebral life. You, you would like that. Okay. So let's see. Libra, sun, moon, rising, Venus, and north. Now let's get it popping. The five of pentacles. Was that in reverse or the upright? You tell me, Libra. Who you, who you leaving now? Who you rejecting? Who, okay. The five of cups. All right. So. You're really struggling here with a relationship. All right, double fives, 55. You could be seeing five, five, but something is about to change. Whenever you see five, five, don't get scared. I hope you prepare for that shit. Like I always prepare for five, five. Five, five means changes, obstacles, challenges. You could be having a personal five day today, all right? The nine of wands, okay, yeah, but stay in the fight. I feel I like you are. This is the thing about challenges and obstacles. When you're prepared for them, it's not a challenge. When you're prepared, it's not an obstacle. When you're prepared, it's not a problem. All right. Don't even look at shit as problems. Everything is a project. Everything is a everything is an opportunity to learn. Everything is an opportunity to gain experience. Okay. So experience is what you get when you don't get what you want. All right. Good shit. The tower, I say, the tower. Okay, so why are you staying? Why are you staying in a situation that's a rut? I feel like you're. I feel like you're. You're staying in a situation here, Libra. That's it. That's that's irreparable. It's, it, it cannot be fixed. Like this is this is a situation. You're fighting for something that can't be fixed. This could be a relationship. Okay. This is, but this could be something that you were fighting for. You could have been fighting for something that that's not. You cannot fix a situation. All right. The tower and the reverse. The tower and the upright. Yes, the tower is being destroyed, but it's still a tower and the upright. It can be rebuilt. Like this. Once the shit is once once it's done, it's done. It's done. All right. It's done. Like, like this is this is something like that's and with the nine of wands being here, this could be something that's in your past because this is like background. The eight of wands is in the, the eight of wands is in the background here. Okay, so this could be like some, somebody could have said something like eight of wands. We all know as messages, things coming to fruition. But this is like this is like things coming into fruition, things materializing that we have thought of, that we have planted. So the eight of wands is something that's it's like the eight of wands is the seed, the seeds that you have sown growing. It's not it's, it's like it's all about you. It's all about your passion and shit. Right. So this could be something in your past or something, um, a relationship in your past here that you put a lot of time, energy, effort into. OK, something something that you were spiritually something that you were very passionate about here. You were connected to this spiritually. All right. This is Platonian energy here. But this is like something something was transformed. Like it, but it will never be the same. It will never go back to the way it was. It, it never. This could be you. All right. Like I feel like I, I feel like you've been fighting for some time here, but I, I feel like you are not the same by any means. Like you will never be that person again, ever. Like, and I feel like this could be scaring somebody off here. All right. But I feel like if it is, if this is not you, you're fighting for a situation that's no. Okay. So the world, yeah. So I feel like. This is so this is the six of swords to me is my science card. It's like being in between situations. It's it's having the science and knowledge to know how to take yourself from a, some bad shit to, to something else. I feel like you're going back and forth to, with the, between a situation that's not going anywhere. Like I, and I feel like come on now, Libra, you're you're cerebral. Like, you know, I feel like this is I feel like this is involving science, okay? But I feel like science is involved. I feel like astrology is involved. When I say science, I'm speaking of astrology, numerology and tarot. Okay, we're talking about planetary bodies here. Okay, we have the world. Okay, so I feel like I feel like the situation cannot be mended. It's not supposed to be mended here. And I feel like because of the the, the science, the charts, I feel like okay, this is why it's so important to know your 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 numer your your chart, your numerology, all that shit. Because some things just can't be. When you have a square or, or, or opposition, some things just cannot happen. Some things just cannot be. There's just the chart will not allow for it. the NATO, the two NATO charts do not it is they're incompatible okay there is is they're incompatible to the point where they cannot work together at all all right 
it's like oil and water. They're going it, it, it like doesn't matter. They're always going to separate. It's like they th this, this these two things cannot be emulsified. All right, period. This could be a relationship or a creative endeavor. It just cannot happen the way you want it to happen, or it cannot happen at all. All right, and that's the gospel truth. All right, so it says, it says the um. All right, so it says the let's see the the two of swords in the reverse. So you could be realizing this, the two because the two of swords is like the the universe. It's like at a standstill, being like you you can't make a decision. You're indecisive, but you're you're indecisive because it's like it's not going anywhere because you're fighting for a situation. It's like it's just going to be it's just going to be back and forth, back and forth. It could be with another air sign, air sign rising. Okay, but I feel like. You're just, you're just going to go back and forth. And I'm getting, wow, we have twins here. This could be a twin flame. You guys could have twin charts. And, but I feel like this is, so, wow. So what is a twin flame? Now I'm, I'm about to break this down, this shit real down. A twin flame is not somebody you just, you fuck with real hard. No, a twin flame means twin charts. So in Western, you and this person have to, it, it literally, your charts have to line up. Like if you have Aries in the first house, they're going to have Libra in their seventh house or vice versa. If they have Taurus in their, and, and you have, if you have Taurus in your first house, they're going to have Scorpio there because that's the opposite of Taurus. And you're also going to be lined up in a Vedic too. So this is like you and this person have twin charts. That's why it cannot work. It's, it's, or it cannot work right now, whatever that, but I feel like this is a situation that's just, it, it cannot be mended because of the science behind it. You have to understand the science behind, if you have, but I feel like, I don't know, I'm getting like twin charts here, here twin flames. Okay, but I feel like too, you could have thought somebody was your twin, but they're not. They're, 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 their chart is not compatible with your chart. All right, this could be another air sign here. Double air. Both of y'all could be double air. This shit is not going to work because it's, it's too much air energy. It's too much intellect. It's too, it, it, it's too much of a good thing, right? Because there has to be a balance here. All right. Like if you're, if, if somebody, if you were double air, somebody was double fire, it could work. But I feel like both of you are double air and it cannot work. There's too, there's, there's too much of something here. And that's why, that's why you keep going back and forth. It's, it's always going to be a push and pull always, 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 because you have to, there's a science here and stop, stop fighting with it. You know who I'm talking about, Libra. You know who I'm talking about. I ain't got to tell you, you know your life, but there's a push and pull here. You want to make it, it just cannot be right. All right. Let's see. Okay, so the seven of cups, yeah, I feel like, okay, you're realizing this. You're, this is something that you have been fighting for, something that you were fighting for, you're no longer fighting for because the seven of cups is here. Okay, so seven of cups in reverse is you coming back, you snapping back to reality, okay? Shit got real. Somebody here had a rude awakening about someone. You could have found out someone's science. Like, this is the thing. Astrology is the, astrology natal chart is the map of your life. It's, it represents life cycles. It represents the cycles that you are going to live here. So how do you break the cycle? By knowing the science, by understanding the map. Ooh, damn, I just, I should just, damn, I just want to deep on y'all real quick. But yeah, so this is you. You're understanding the cycles. You're understanding the, the karma, the, the map of your life. You understand that this shit just cannot work. It's not going to work. All right. Why is the six of swords here in the reverse? Okay, the, the six of pentacles. You are no, you cannot give your attention to, stop giving your attention to it. I feel like I feel like you you keep going back and forth trying to figure out, but you st stop giving your energy to it. Whoever is it a fire sign with air rising, air rising fire moon, some shit like that. Stop giving it your energy. It's not gonna work. And I feel like this. I feel like whoever this person is, it's this. It's like somebody here. It's it's like not even a big deal like that. This person is not even a big deal. Like the, the six of wands. Yes, it's praise. It's glory. It's recognition. It's getting attention. But it's like. Who are you really getting attention from? These are, they're, they're, first of all, they're faceless. They're nameless. They're nobody. The only, the only person you've seen in the picture is the, is this person. So it's like, who are these people praising you? They ain't nobody. I feel like this person is not even, I feel like you're putting this person higher than what they are. Like, I feel like this person is like, not even, like, not even all that like that. Why is it two of swords here in the reverse? I hate, if you're, if you're a cross watcher, I'm sorry. I got to keep it 100. All right. I feel like, let's see. The, the ten of swords, yeah. I feel like here you're trying to, you keep trying to think outside the box about a situation, but it, keep le it keeps leading to the same thing. Keep getting led to the same shit. I mean, I feel, I feel like you don't want to hear it because it's painful. You wanted it to work. This could have already happened, though. I'm, I'm getting like, this could have happened already. But I feel like you keep you keep researching science. You keep, you keep researching the science. You keep looking into it. You keep 
you keep but it, you keep finding the same shit. You keep coming to the same conclusion. And I but I feel like this is a situation too. You might be thinking like, okay, well this person is not for me. This situation cannot be mended. I will I, I will never fuck with them again. I'm so done with this person. But every time you look into the science behind this person, you and this person, you see the same shit. You have twin charts. You're like, damn. It's like the more you look into it, the more this person is for you. All right. Okay. So the six of pentacles. But I feel like. Here you're. I feel like you're still being very selfish. Here you're still like no. You're. I feel like you're gonna. You're, you're trying to find any means here to make this not work. If that's. Not, if it could be. This could go in so many ways. But I'm getting twin charts, twin flame. Okay, because it's deeper than just I love you. You know we have a deep. No, a twin flame is twin charts. That's a. It's it's deeper than okay. A soulmate is different. You can have a soulmate. Yeah, you can, you can have many soulmates, but a twin flame. That's some scientific shit. It's scientific. You have to understand the science. Like you and this person. Are, are the same fucking person. That's what I'm saying. Like, a twin flame is a twin chart. Twin charts. Wow, that's mag that shit is remarkable. Like, if that's the thing, if you are really a twin like that, I'm telling you, like, but you feel, but that's the thing about the twin flame journey. You hate that shit. It's karma. The twin flame journey is karma. It's the, it's the most difficult, painful shit you will ever experience in your motherfucking life. It's karma. People think people want to be a twin flame. That shit is a karma. It's a karmic destiny. It shit hurt. It's hurtful. It's stressful. It pisses you the fuck off. It disturbs your life. It disturbs every fucking thing. It's just, oh my God. It's such a burden. But some of us are some of us are cursed with the twin flame journey, right? We have a fucking twin flame. All right, so the, the hidden influences are in reverse. Yeah, so I feel like here. I'm also gonna, I'm also gonna pull a love one for this because I'm getting like a relationship, some relationship shit here. Um but this could be like a relationship that you could find out something. You could also find out that something is not right. I'm getting something is not right and something is. Like both, a whole bunch of shit here. Double shit, twin shit. This is a twin reading shit. Somebody ain't right and somebody is somebody is like so right is scary. Shit. Gemini. All right. But the arts though, I feel like, um, are you into the arts? Why is the arts in reverse? I don't understand why it's in reverse though. That's the hidden influence. Why? Let's see. All right, yin and yang, creating harmony through balance. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so but the arts, but I feel like okay, so you're not. I feel like okay, so it's not. A, it's not artist. I feel like it's more science. This is more of a scientific reading here. All right, something you're finding out. Somebody here refusing to work. I'm, I need another. What is what is this arts card in reverse? I'm so confused. How is this about art? Are are you are you expressing this through art? Are you writing this down? Are you speaking this? Libra. Is this someone else? Is this someone else's situation that you are handling? I don't know. But I feel like you're you're giving a lot of attention to some some type of science or study. Wow, the wow the electro the the color spectrum here. If anybody has the thought tarot deck, what does this card mean? I always say this is the card of the unknown. I like to make up my own meanings, but something is like you're you're exploring something here because you're trying to know more about it. Something about the art. Something about uh, somebody's chart. Because something like something is so unknown to you. Like I feel like this is like something is something is so something is so accurate. It could be scary to you. Like. You just don't, you just can't put your finger on this shit, like, okay? Mm, I don't know, Libra, it's crazy. Palmistry, interpretation, are you a palm, are you a palmist? Yeah, somebody here is def, somebody here is definitely, like, some type of, some type of, uh, mystic. Like, you could be finding this out about yourself. Are you reading your palms? You could be, you could be, uh, yeah, because I have a lot of hands here. Somebody has a palmist or getting into palmistry. Somebody studying palmistry here. I have a lot of hands here. Yeah, somebody studying palmistry. Somebody studying their palms, looking at their palms. Could be studying the palms of your friends here. Wow, all right. Good shit. But I feel like something about your palms, you, you need to look into Libra. That could be um, significant to you as well. Let's see what you have for love here. Okay, honeymoon. The honeymoon is over. It says enjoy. Like I said, some you're, you could be, oh, who had this? Virgo. 
you could be meeting are you you could be meeting a virgo here oh my gosh okay so because virgo got the, the virgo is going to be fixed in a certain location you could be encountering a virgo all right like the honeymoon is over you could have been traveling now you're not traveling anymore you could have been on vacation now you're coming back home here but i feel like i feel like you and virgo or something you're going to be meeting a virgo okay i feel like there's there's a virgo in you that are supposed to meet okay I feel like this Virgo is going to help you. You guys are going to work together or something like that. But I feel like, so like, because the honeymoon being here, like the honeymoon phase is over in the situation. This is not, this is not a new relationship. It could be, but I feel like this is, this is not about the Virgo, I don't think. But I feel like this could be something new. But I feel like this is about something old, an old relationship. Okay, a twin or a soulmate. But I feel like, because like, this is like the honeymoon phase. Like, oh, the cupcake phase. Or, you know, I'm just falling in love with you. No, this is like been a long time coming. This is like somebody you have history with. But I feel like on a side note, you're gonna be, you're probably gonna meet a Virgo that's very significant to you here. All right, so good shit. I hope this helps you. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.